Hey, what's up sports bettors, Alex here. And what we're gonna be doing in this video is placing a few mathematically profitable bets. So a lot of these wagers were from the Odds Jam positive expected value page, which shows you mathematically profitable bets. And then we also have sports betting promos. So, you know, FanDuel, Caesars, looking through the sports betting promos and trying to take advantage of them. Um, in this video, I didn't take advantage of all the promos, but you can see right here, like Caesars has placed $1,000 in live wagers and you get a $300 free bet. That's clearly, you know, profitable. You're getting 30% of your money back that you bet live and free bets up to $1,000. So this is definitely a promo that you want to take advantage of. So we can get into it. And our first tracked bet was from the Odd Jam Positive Expected Value page. We have the Canucks money line for $500 at plus 112 odds. So if we just scroll into the Canucks game, lines have been drifting towards the Canucks and you can see they're now down to plus 105 on win bet. We got them plus 112, which was, you know, an arb to pinnacle, the sharpest sports book out there, which you can see right here. So that's the first bet we have. Um, the next bet we have is a promo on FanDuel. So you can see right here, FanDuel has this promotion called NHL Parlay Insurance. So if you place a four leg parlay with cash on the NHL and you lose exactly one leg, then you get your money back. So this is a mathematically profitable promo. There's a previous video that shows that this promotion is profitable. And what we did to find our wagers is we looked for line discrepancies. Like I'll see if I can find an example. So if we go into the stars game and we just look at one of the legs we had and then we go to total goals. All we're looking for is lines that are best offered on FanDuel, right? You can see for under 6.5 goals, FanDuel is giving you minus, 150, minus 154 odds, whereas Pinnacle is all the way down at min, minus one, 197. So lines are ripping towards the under. Twin Spires is at minus 175, DraftKings minus 175, and Caesars minus 160. So it definitely seems like minus 154 is a pretty good leg to include in our parlay. So we have under 6.5 um, in the Senators game, under 6.5 in the Kraken game, under 6.5 in Blackhawks, and under 6.5 in the Red Wings game. Um, and again, this Blackhawks game is the Blackhawks Stars game, and this is the exact leg we have. Under 6.5, minus 154. You can see FanDuel hasn't moved. They're still giving you the best price on the under, so this would be a great leg to include in your parlay. Um, then we have two promos on Twin Spires that were emailed to me. So I was limited on one of them, which is pretty annoying. So I should add the limited column there. But you can see we got Panthers money line, a promo from Twin Spires boosted to plus 600 odds. And Broncos money line, again, this is a promo boosted to plus 200 odds. So if we go into the Broncos game, what we can do is we can click in and we can look at the Broncos game. You can see that the Broncos are minus 146 favorites, right? And we're getting plus 200 odds on Twin Spires from this promotion. So that's obviously a pretty incredible betting opportunity. So that's what we have next. Then we have a few bets from the Odd Jam Positive Expected Value page. We have Buck Saints under 43.5 points. Um, on win bet for $250 plus 140 odds. We have Colts Patriots under 48.5 points on DraftKings. We have Raptors Senators um, parlay boost on win bet for $250. And then we have a few more parlays on um, win bet sportsbook. So we've said this before, but win bet gives you, you know, tokens whenever you have a bet lose that can be redeemed for these parlay boosts. So what we ended up going with was Senators money line in under 49.5 points in the Saints game at plus 360 odds in Vikings Bears under 48.5 Saints Bucks under 49.5 at plus 198 odds. Um, then a few more plus EV bets. We have three or two hockey bets. So we have under 6.5 in the Canucks game for $125 at minus 125 odds on win bet. We have Western Michigan minus 4.5 on Twin Spires. We were limited on this, so I'm forgetting to add these columns. We have North Carolina minus six on Twin Spires and the Golden Knights um, minus 118 on Twin Spires. So these are all the bets that we have for today. We're tracking our profit and loss. So it's been a a wild ride in terms of profit and loss. We went up 4K pretty, pretty
pretty quickly. We were running hot. Then we went down 4K. We were running really bad. And now we're back to roughly flat. So we have some open bets. So hopefully, you know, betting mathematically, we start to see that profit tick up and up and up. Again, all we're doing in these videos is looking at these sports betting promos, looking through, you know, odds jam for line discrepancies. There's no picks, none of that BS. We're just looking for, you know, bets like this, essentially. Darren Elkins, you can see he's plus 166 on FanDuel. Lines are ripping towards him. He's all the way down to plus 140 on Pinnacle, you know, plus 145 on DraftKings. So FanDuel's an ARB to both DraftKings. It's an ARB to Pinnacle. So this seems like a great you know, betting opportunity, right? Like it's an ARB to two sports books. You're clearly getting value odds on FanDuel at plus 166. So I hope you found this video helpful. Any questions you have about sports betting, what sports books to get in your state, anything like that, you can reach out to us. And again, thank you so much for your time.